Alright, today what I'm going to attempt to show you is how to mod TTR. Uh, basically, what I'm just going to show you is when it says, like, perfect or good or whatever it says. I'm just going to show you how to change that in any way you want. Really, you can do whatever. But, oh wait, I need that. Alright, I have my iPod browser, and I have my iPod hooked up down here. See? And then, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go under Applications. It's loading. We're going to highlight, or click on TTR. Dot, uh, app. And what we're going to do is we're going to go down, we're going to find, what I'm going to do is perfect.png. It says, if you preview, it says sweet down here. Alright, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to copy, save as to my desktop. And it's saving as perfect, so I'll, I'll just go find it. And then it's saved down here. So I'm going to open that, and I'm going to edit it. doesn't really matter what you do. Um, first of all, what I'm going to do is I'm going to blow it up about 400%. So stretch and skew. I'm going to hit 400 times 400. For any of you who haven't done that in math yet, that's like four times its size. Um, and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my paintbrush here and I'm going to dress it up a little. Uh, so I'm going to take, I'm going to make this red, I guess. Actually, I'm going to make this square. I'm just going to do like that. Make it say sweet and red. Now you can take as much time as this with you. As much time as you need on this. I'm just doing it quickly to show you. Alright, and then what we're going to do is we're going to... We're going to scale it back down. So we're going to do 25% of its actual size. Which will take it back to its um, actual size. You want it both horizontally and vertically, 25%. Sing goes for 400, and it's back to the original size. Now what we're going to do is we're going to go under Attributes, or whatever. And it, it has to be 150, 150 right here, by 40 pixels. And that's 150 width, height should be 40. Make sure it's pixels, not like centimeters or inches, because that will mess you up. And that's exactly what it needs to be. Alright, so what we're going to do is we're going to do save as, and we're going to put it, I'm going to put it on my desktop again, hit yes, close this, alright, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to delete perfect.png right here, delete file, click and drag, now I need to find it again, perfect.png, hit preview, and it's red again. Alright, so um, hopefully that'll work. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to reset my iPod. You can probably just reset Springboard, but I'm going to completely restore it. Just because a lot of people don't have SMB prefs. Alright, while it's doing that, I'm going to tell you about some other stuff you can do. Um, what I've been looking into is actually taking an... Oh, I can't show you right now because my iPod is still turning on. Um, I was going to go and... I don't know if you guys want to try this, but I wanted to try to change the clicking sound on the iPod to something a little more, I don't know, odd, like a squeaky noise. But if you guys want to look into doing that, I might look into doing that, but that's something interesting I've been looking into. Alright, so my iPod has reset, so I'm going to go to TTR... Tap Tap Revolution, iTunes Library, let's go with Green Day today. Alright, yeah, I'm getting sweets here. Um... I don't know, this is the first time I've tried this, and it's got that white around it. I'm not sure how you could eliminate that. One thing you might try is not ballooning it up like I did, and just leave it at, like, um, the 150 by 40 instead of making it four times its size. You could try that. But anyway, that's basically what it does. 
And basically, you can mod anything you want, the background or anything. You just have to make sure it compares with the original size and everything. But, that's how you do it, basically.